everyone! Hello! And welcome to a new video on Jimmy Choo this time, yes. particularly their Blossom fragrances, because there are two now, oh. a new one called Special Edition. Okay, so I don't know what you know about Jimmy Choo, I'm sure. Does everyone know they do shoes? I think that's what most people yes. know. Yes, sure. And every woman out there certainly yeah. knows that Jimmy Choo do shoes. Yeah, <laughs> shoes and bags and all kinds of accessories. Yeah. Leather goods. And fragrances. Mm -hmm. um, and actually in the UK, um, the Jimmy Choo fragrances are incredibly popular. Oh, they're massive. I mean, I think maybe it is more of a UK thing because it's a British brand. It is, yeah. Yeah. Um, so Jimmy Choo, um, were, I mean, he set up quite a long time ago now mm -hmm. as yeah. a cobbler, yeah. you know, um, but then I think it really catapulted to fame because um, Tamara Mellon, um, who was then the accessories um, editor of Vogue, I mm -hmm. believe, um, kind of caught on to this idea that people wanted beautiful shoes, mm -hmm. teamed up with Jimmy Choo and then kind of transported it to a bit of a red carpet brand. Much more glamorous, mm -hmm. yes. Mm -hmm. um, and it is now, you know, the, the brand of the rich and famous in yeah, terms of shoes, is, really. Um, so they have lots of different lines within their fragrance portfolio. We've shown you things um, mm. before, but I don't think we've ever talked about the Blossom no. line. Um, so should we talk about the original one yeah. first? Yours, you match it absolutely Perfect. perfectly today. <laughs> this packaging is made for that top. Yes. I love the sparkle, you know, on this. Boxes are beautifully mm. sparkly. Um, they've got that real kind of party feel yeah. to them, as the brand does. Um, but also, the, the name Blossom um, is really evoking that feeling of springtime mm. when all mm. the blossoms come out on the mm. trees and the flowers and um, when this one launched back in 2015 it also launched in kind of early springtime in mm. fragrance we're always way ahead yeah we of are what's actually like we launched spring fragrances in january we launched summer fragrances in april know, nice. <laughs> so we talk about christmas in june yes yeah. so. <laughs> but this is a spring fragrance um so this, um i was gonna say this name thinks makes me think yes. of spring yes and the fragrance as well um, is, for me, I think it's very juicy berries. Yeah, juicy berries. It's like a cocktail. Yes, like kind of crushed mm. raspberries and things. It's got that nice Bulgarian rose element it to has. it, uh, combined with a sweet pea. We don't actually talk that much about no. sweet pea perfume, um, so it's quite an unusual one. But Bulgarian rose mm. is very well known, yeah. um, and it gives that kind of warmth and depth to the floral. Um, heart. Yes. And I really like the fact that, I mean, it's sweet for sure. It taps into that sort of fruity floral. It's not sickly, but it's, it's not juicy sickly. sweet. Mm. Yeah. Mm. And, you know, pink, you can't go wrong with pink, can you? So, um, yeah, that's the original Jimmy Choo Blossom. And then something new is, as Georgina said, the special edition, which is in more of a kind of coral. Yeah, it's kind of peach. Kind of... Yeah, peachy orange um, colour, which is also mm. beautiful and really inspired by their latest collection in shoes and bags. Yeah, I suppose their idea, I mean, the whole thing about if you go out in your Jimmy Choo bag and shoes, mm. etc., um, you kind of feel glamorous and ready to shine and sparkle. That's kind of the idea behind yeah. it. Um, and they do a lot, a lot of their packaging matches the colourways in their accessory lines. So you, they're doing a lot of this peachy, pinky mm. colour at the moment. Um, should we have a spray? Yes. So, same bottle design, mm -hmm. uh, which is actually the flash bottle. Uh, yes, same, uh, same as flash. bottle, which yeah. reminds me of a paparazzi flash bulb, you know, yeah. the old fashioned ones. Um, this one is not so red berry, is it? It's more mango. Mm. Yeah, it's really, actually, I think I prefer it. On first, yes. on first now, heat. What? And I like red berries. I like the kind of lipstick. Oh, reminds me of something. Red berries, but this one is like a, a fresh. It's very exotic. It's very tropical. Yeah. Isn't it? Like tropical island. Yes. I feel like I could go on holiday with yes. this. Yes. Really happy. Yes, yes. Oh, lovely. Yeah, mango. I mean, it might even have like passion fruit yeah. or something like that in there as well. Mm. It's more like, oh dear, I'm really sorry, Jimmy Choo, because it's probably <laughs> not appropriate. But do you remember there was a drink called Umbungo? I was just going to say, a drink, <laughs> yes, Umbungo. Um do you remember Umbungo? Um um I don't think that it's still going. No, I don't think I it's used still. to love it as yes, a child. Yes, tropical. It smells like that. Yeah. Which is, I mean, in my book, that's really good. Uh, it would be great on holiday. Yeah. Yeah. Um, the floral is, um, again, fitting in with the holiday theme, which is that kind of frangy, pally, yeah. exotic. Nice um, flower. Yeah. It's that kind of, it reminds me of kind of Hawaiian islands. Yes. And the, you like, know, the lays. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Um, but I feel like this is something that is kind of 
great for a new season because we're coming it is. as we come out of winter and you head towards kind of the sunshine in the spring i don't know about you i want something that reflects that brightens you up yes. a bit yes you yeah. want you want a change you want something fresh mm. something lively um so this is definitely ticking all those boxes so let us know what you think if you've tried any of those blossom fragrances we'd love to know your thoughts and we'll see you again next week bye, bye.